got. You we're out here uh, the last Sunday in July. Beautiful morning. And uh, we're planning on catching a lot of fish. So stay tuned and see what happens. Back on another one. Three or four days you'll be able to watch yourself catch fish. That's a good one right there. There we go, he's doing it again. Another really nice fish. Close to 10 pounds. That's a good one. Peeling some line off. I expect that one to come to the top here pretty soon. Kind of watching for that one to come up behind the boat. It hasn't surfaced yet. The angle of the line, I don't think it's very deep because it hasn't come to the top yet. It may dive deep once it sees the boat right here. Coming right up alongside the boat. So that's the broken surface. Now I'm trying to get under the boat. They all like to try to do that. It's giving him a workout. <laughs> All that line you worked so hard to get, he's taking it back out again. And we're doubled up. Back up here a little bit and you can see them both. Back up here, and you could see them fighting them side by side, back to back, or however you want to look at it. Well, that one finally came up to the top for a second. Back. Yeah. Well, both of them are up at the top. I got it. To, and we're tripled up. We got a third one on here. Yep, we need to get one more. We got one guy that's not hooked up. Let's get a little glimpse of this one here, and I got to net it. There we go. One's not quite as big as the other two, but uh, we're still getting them three at a time. That big one's clear in the back. You can't really tell how big he is because of that, but he's a good fish. And he is wearing them out back here. found a pile of them down there because you can get one right after another. Either that or you're just catching that same one over and over again. It just really likes shrimp. Yeah. Another big one. <laughs> I like that sound. Make a run on you. You got some grunting and groaning.
Yeah, I just, just saw a glimpse of it there in the current. And you can see that current swirling around behind the boat. Kind of looks like the motor's running. That's a good current. You get just the right amount of current. Things really, uh, things really get wild around here. go. Another beauty. Oh, we got that one in the boat. We got another one pulling line up here. He's, uh, he's pulling some drag. And it was, you can tell there just has to be an incredible number of fish down there to be able to catch them like this. Every once in a while you see a water skier up here and if they had any idea how many of these big cats are down there they'd probably be afraid to get in the water end up like Jonah Giving us a shower. Back it. There we go. Good fish. You going at it? Thanks. Oh, be careful! <laughs> Almost had to net you. <laughs> There we go. Just like Noah, we're collecting them two by two. <laughs> oh, there we go. He's on another one. Been out here an hour and 45 minutes. Been a lot of fish in the boat already. doubled up again. Uh, no, we got, he got off. This is a good one though. Still not two hours into the trip and he's complaining he's getting tired already. But, uh, it's just important to end up on the right boat. That's all. Got all these boats around us, but uh, it just—it's important to be on the right one. It's still on up here in the front. We just got that one in. We got one on back here, so we're tripled again. It's a nice fish he's got on here. There he is. Back he goes. And we got the fourth one. All four guys got their fish now. It, uh, oh, yeah, that's got that rod bit good. Oh, yeah, he's, there we go. He's coming up on the side of the boat. I got a net that one. Got them all on the boat. We got fish here, a big one there. He got a little pan sized fish here, but uh, we already released that one. There's still four guys, four fish. There we go, that's another nice fish. So he said that's his biggest one so far. I'm hoping he gets some even bigger than that before we're done, but that's a beauty right there. Two big ones on again. Got one here, one over there. So. Uh, 
catching them missing here's closest to the boat got another big fish in the back though there that one is I'm at it back to the back of the boat the rod's got a nice bend to it Even beyond the big ones. Oh, got one on yours. Yeah, go get that. I'll take care of it now. He let go of it. Hey, you're gonna leave it out there and let him have a chance to hit it again. Missed that one. Good thing is out here right now, if you miss one, it's not very long until you find the next one. That's a good one. All right, they're trying to get their lines untangled, and the other line's got a fish on it. So this one fish got into his line, wrapped him up pretty good, but he's trying to untangle that, and the whole time there's a fish tugging on the line. And we got one in the net up front still that I got to take care of, but uh, that's that's what happens to you out here if that line's in the water. It's usually got a fish on it. There we go, got that other one off the hook. We got this one here, and there's that one that he was trying to get untangled. Uh, that's that's what was pulling on it while he was trying to work on it. So. Can you let this one go? Yeah, you can go ahead and let that one go. Off the side though, if you would. If you try to put them off the back, they end up bouncing off the side of the boat. Oh, be careful. There's a couple guys that thought I was going to have to bail out of the water. I haven't lost anybody overboard yet, but we're trying. <laughs> I just heard a big splash up front where they released that one. Released this one here. Just got the third one in the boat. And the fourth one sucked up. Yeah. Well, they can't all be 10 pounds, but a lot of them are. There he is. That'd make a perfect sandwich, though. There we go. That's the one that caused all the trouble that was on the line while while they were tangled up. But uh, just another good fish. Damn. We got one up here. Oh, yeah. Stop. You hook into those monsters like that, it just like hooked me into a log. I had a double there for for a few seconds, but. Uh, yeah, we got a double again. We had one get off. We still got two on. There he is. He ain't very big. All nice right. fish. That one you can lift in or you need uh, the net? I'll probably net him. All right, I'll get him for you. All right, I got it. Oh, we got us a triple. We got a volunteer to net him, so I get... Get back to filming again. Well, that was good. One behind me just peeling offline. This one is on the surface already, way back there. That one's coming in right on top of the water.
there's a nice fish right here and there's a big one in the front of the boat too he's I still hear a line peel off of that reel every now and then we get this one in we'll go to that one yeah it's really nice having somebody to jump in and grab the net this one here is getting pretty close to the top I think Oh, that bait made a big splash. There it goes again. Taking off to the bottom. If it swallowed it, yeah, just cut it loose. Or it's just already unhooked, you're turning it loose. Yeah, I had to cut the line, he swallowed it. Okay, well, we'll leave that hook in there, he'll be all right. Take that hook out, he'd bleed to death. But There, that one's back in the water. We are still fighting this monster here. This, uh, this fish just does not want to give up. Another one of those big ones that they've landed a few fish while well, he's been fighting this one. Oh, Misty. Yeah. yeah, you don't want to have that happen too many times, but he's still on there, so that's the main thing. Yeah, he swam right into the net that time. Master net. Yeah, good job. Woo. All right, I got it. Oh, we got us a triple. We got a volunteer to net him, so I get get back to filming again. Well, that was good. One behind me just peeling offline. This one is on the surface already, way back there. That one's coming in right on top of the water. There's a nice fish right here, and there's a big one in the front of the boat, too. He's, I still hear a line peel off of that reel every now and then. We get this one in, we'll go to that one. Yeah, it's really nice having somebody to jump in and grab the net. This one here is getting pretty close to the top, I think.
Whoa, that bass made a big splash. There it goes again. Taking off for the bottom. If it swallows it, yeah, just cut it loose. Or it's just already unhooked, you're turning it loose. Yeah, I had to cut the line, he swallowed it. Okay, well, we'll leave that hook in there, he'll be all right. Take that hook out, he'd bleed to death, but. There, that one's back in the water. We are still fighting this monster here. This, uh, this fish just does not want to give up. Another one of those big ones that they've landed. A few fish. Oh, well, he's been fighting this one. have that happen too many times but he's still on there so that's the main thing hey he swam right into the net that time master net yeah good job oh uh, that was that was losing some eggs. We need to get her back in the water. She's dropping eggs. Yeah. You know, I probably want to get her back in the water while she's still got some eggs left. There we go. That's a beautiful fish right there. That's that's another one to go. Good 12 pounds. And we got one hooked up behind me too. Yeah, we are doubled once again. We got one here. Got one over here. Looks like both big ones again. Yeah, you gonna net that one? All right, there's one. That's a nice fish. I think uh, one in the back may be bigger than this one. This one's uh, putting up a bit more of a fight, so. Bunch of guys over in that other boat were kind of watching the action. Old Jeff's a good guy though, so I shouldn't give him too much slack just because he doesn't know how to fish. It doesn't doesn't mean he's not a nice guy. Big one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That, I, oh. I got a glimpse of it that time. It's uh, pretty thick. Old time he's trying to help out over here, his rod's just <laughs> bouncing. I don't think his boat gonna be quite as big as, as this monster here, but uh, 
This rod was just a bouncing though. Bait. Yep. Why? That looked good next to some hush puppies though. <laughs> That's a beautiful fish. Said uh, a couple hours into it, and he's already complaining he's tired. He he's lined up for six hours of this. He, I'm he's not complaining. <laughs> I'm not complaining. You don't want me to move you someplace where you don't catch them so fast. I'm going to trade with one of these guys so they can so they can catch some. I think they've been catching some too. He got a real squealing again. I hope you get it right. Yeah, his fish wanted to get caught in the back of the boat. He started out clear over at the other side. This one, uh, this one took a trip all the way around the boat. Well, halfway around anyway. Yeah, now he's gonna go back. Got something on over there? <laughs> you got one? Oh yeah. <laughs> I think you got a tiger by the tail. I think it's going to be a uh, fish and a half here. Try not to reel so much though when the reel's squealing like that because it's twisting the heck out of your line. You still got another three hours to fish with that. your best one that's so far one. yeah that's what I like to hear that's another big fish that's another probably 14 pounds I have to get it on the scale but uh, it's probably pretty close that's another big fish that's another probably 14 pounds I have to get it on the scale but uh, it's probably pretty close Go. You just put both those fish in the net. That's a net full. That thing was heavy to lift into the boat. They looked like twins <laughs> right there side by side. There we are, twins. Two really nice fish. Two, two uh, big males. <laughs> the boat's turning. That fish is so big it's towing the boat. Uh, really. Really, the current's changing on us. Uh, pretty good. Fish are still biting though, so that's all that matters. Not very, not 
But, uh, yeah, the current's just about stopped on us. Big fish probably still bite for a little while yet, just don't know how long. All you can do is enjoy it while it lasts. We'll still catch fish after that, I'd imagine, but uh, little ones might move in. There we go. That's beauty. So uh, we're still got a couple hours left in the trip, but I've got more video than I can use now. So <laughs> we'll probably be calling it quits on the recording, but uh, there's still going to be a lot more fish caught.